What's up everyone? This is Ralph with Faith to Achieve, where our focus is on creating high quality, Bible-based content to help you live the abundant life you were created to live. I'd like to welcome you if this is your first time joining us, and also ask you to click the subscribe button as well as the bell, so you'll be the first to be notified of any new content that we produce, and you can find links to anything we discuss in the description box below. So let's go ahead and get started. So today I want to talk to you about why I believe this is one of the most important times of the year. You see, there's almost 100 days left in 2018. It's hard to believe that so much time has passed, but 2018 is almost over. Now, if you've set goals in the beginning of the year and you're making steady progress, congratulations, that's a big effort. A lot of things can happen during the year that can throw you off track, but if you're still on track, hats off to you. If you haven't set goals or if you're off track, don't worry, this is not a video to condemn you. This is just an opportunity for us to stop what we're doing, recalibrate and make sure that we finish strong because you can achieve more in just a few short weeks or months than most people do in a year or even several years. So don't be discouraged, be encouraged, and let's go ahead and build some momentum towards a strong finish. One of the tools that has been so helpful to me is a program by one of my mentors, Gary Ryan Blair, and it's called the 100 Day Start Fast, Finish Strong Challenge. And this is a program designed to help you reach your goals. The 100 Day Challenge is an excellent program that takes a small sample of time relative to a year, 100 days, where you just focus nonstop on what it is that's most important to you. It could be spiritual goals, professional, financial, personal, health and fitness, whatever it is, this program covers it and it's one of the best programs, if not the best program I've seen out there. Each day you're going to receive an email in your inbox that's going to give you a five to seven minute motivational and inspirational video. And it's not just a bunch of hype, it's not just something to pump you up, it's not a rah-rah session. There are practical tools, strategies, and steps that are, again, in very small bite sizes that you can take and use as a focal point for the day. So the thing that I like most about the program is the fact that it's not something that consumes a ton of my time. It's something that I can get early. Usually comes in, I would say, sometime around 5 a.m., 4 a.m. So by the time I wake up, which is usually 4 or 5 a.m., it's already in my inbox and I can hit the ground running with something inspirational to get my mind on the right track. You know, each day, as the Bible says, you have to renew your mind. You renew it with the word, but you also renew it with things that are positive, things that are true, just, pure, lovely, a good report, as it says in the Bible. So I like waking up and starting my day with the word and also with this motivational video uh, that you receive every day for 100 days. In addition, there are online resources. There's an online community where you can connect with people who maybe share similar goals and similar passions. The thing that I like about it, you know, in addition to those tools and resources, is the fact that the quality of the content, the quality of the videos, the quality of the research, the information is just so well done. I mean, it is really a tremendous program, really fantastically done, and something that I do regularly. It is something that I highly recommend and something that I think will really put you on the fast track to a strong finish to the year. Another reason that I think the end of the year is so important, the last quarter, the last 100 days, is because we often delude ourselves around the holidays to thinking that on January 1st, we can just flip the switch and all of the negative habits that we had just fall away and we're gonna start new and everything is gonna be fine. Now there's nothing wrong with a benchmark and looking to improve year over year, but the end of the year this year, I think, is a great opportunity for you to set goals that are a little bit longer range. Maybe take a look at what you want to accomplish in 2019, but start now. Build your momentum now. Make your mistakes now. Do your research and your study now. Go ahead and get those habits and those muscles in place now, so when January 1st does hit, you already have three months worth of momentum. You are already on the fast track. You already have hit the ground running and you're gonna accomplish more than most people do in a lifetime. You're gonna blow by people. You're gonna blow by goals and benchmarks that you thought might be tough to hit. There are gonna be things that seem daunting now that if you focus in, that if you lock in, if you write the vision, if you make it plain, 
if you set your mind to what it is that you're focused on, you're going to be astonished at what you can accomplish. You really are. And there may be people in your life who are detractors. We all have to deal with that, who ask you what you're doing or tell you you can't do that or find other ways to discourage you. Don't worry about that. That is one of the reasons that I created Faith to Achieve, and that's another benefit of the 100-day Start Fast, Finish Strong Challenge because there's a community of like-minded people. You don't need naysayers in your life. Doesn't mean you can't love them from a distance, but as someone once told me, you can love people from a distance. You don't have to go to lunch with them. So stay away from the kinds of people who are going to detract, you know, who are going to be detractors, who are going to discourage you, who really have too much time on their hands, to be honest, because if they were busy on their goals, they wouldn't have time to criticize yours. And even if someone doesn't understand how you're going to achieve a goal, that doesn't mean that they have to criticize you. It's okay to ask questions, to learn a little bit about it, but there's no reason to be negative in anyone's life. Again, the end of 2018, these last 100 days that we're coming up on are such a critical time. They're so important. You can still accomplish more in the next few months than most people do in an entire year. You can still hit some of, if not all of your goals for 2018 in this last 100 days. Don't think because the majority of the year is gone that it's impossible, that you can't get it done. It absolutely can be done. I'm here to encourage you and support you, and I'm sure you're here to encourage and support me because we need each other. So I'm gonna put a description and uh, a link to the program below. Uh, just so you can kind of get familiar with it and you know take a look at it and see if it's right for you again it's something I highly recommend and I only endorse products and services that I've used personally I don't do a lot of endorsements but when I do it's never something that I heard about or someone else experienced I make sure that I dive in that I reach in my pocket that I invest myself before recommending it to someone else and I can personally tell you that this is something that you won't regret so I hope this has been helpful to you. I'm going to be doing more videos throughout the year, uh, especially these last 100 days, to really help you lock in and start to make some serious progress. Stay focused, put your hands to the plow, and don't look back, and you'll be just blown away with where God takes you. So once again, this is Ralph with Faith to Achieve. Thanks so much for joining me. And always remember that faith plus works equals achievement, and I'll see you next time.